oozing confidence, former DA leader Musi Maimane told those who gathered at the State Theatre in Pretoria that now is the time for South Africans to fight for this country and build a great nation. It is far too important for us to roll up our sleeves and get in the ring and fight for this country rather than be spectators sitting outside. I am here to invite all of us as South Africans to say now is the time that all of us get up together and begin to build this great nation of ours. My man made a very bold statement declaring that he will be running for president come the 2024 general elections. As a humble servant of the people of this country, I want to make this declaration. Many have wondered what I've been doing. Many have wondered where we've been. I think Ubuntu summed it up well. But this morning, this afternoon, in this place, Kotswane, I am here to declare that I will be running for the President of the Republic of South Africa come 2024. This is what we're about and we're going to fight. My man spoke about the social problems that the country is facing, including the high rate of unemployment, and he vowed that if he emerges victorious, unemployment will be a thing of the past. Many people, especially our young people, are worried about where their next job is going to come from. And they think to themselves, this is the only place they've lost their way. I am here to tell those young people that if 70% of you cannot find a job, one day a Bossa government is coming and that Bossa government is going to build, build, come on. Weighing in on Maimane's election campaign, political analyst Asanda Nwasheng says even though Maimane has the experience to occupy senior positions in politics, it's going to be difficult for the party to convince people that they are not similar to the TA. I'm struggling to separate them from Musi Maimane's former political party, the DA, in terms of the kind of things that they're promising, in terms of the policies that they seem to be pushing forward, and the direction and drive and the thrust and narrative of what they want as a political party and what they're actually proposing to the people. And I think that's going to be their biggest, uh, you know, hurdle is to convince people that they are not DA light and that they are not a reincarnation of the DA with black people that Musi Maimane used to lead. The general elections will take place next year and that is when voters will get an opportunity to elect new National Assembly members, including the new President of the Republic. Political parties have started to garner support, trying to convince the masses that they have what it takes to govern one of the richest countries on the African continent. I'm Calvin Lula for SABC News in Pretoria.